Tracking your portfolio on CoinGecko is very easy. First, you will need to type in CoinGecko in your search bar and select CoinGecko.com. You will be directed to the CoinGecko homepage that will give you the option to sign up and create an account. You will need to use your email and a password, after which agree to the terms of service and privacy policy, complete the capture verification and then click sign up. You will need to verify the email and sign in in order to access your new account. Once you're signed in, go to the profile icon on the homepage and select portfolio. You will have the option to see either the main portfolio, which is a default, or to create a new portfolio. We will choose the main portfolio and we will need to add a new coin. We will add XRP and an entry will pop up in our portfolio. It will show the coin, its current price, its PNL over the last one hour, 24 hours and 7 days, its market cap, the graph trend over the last 7 days, your holdings and the PNL based on the amount of fees you had to pay to make a transaction. In order to add a transaction, click on the plus sign on the far right end of your entry and a pop-up will appear where you will see the current price per coin, a bar to add the quantity of crypto coin you bought, which once entered automatically calculates your total spent. You will also see the date you're inputting the transaction and you'll be able to add fees and notes. After you've filled in that information and selected submit, your transaction will reflect in your portfolio. To view your transactions, click the arrow on the far right corner of your entry and you'll be directed to the transaction page. You will also have the option to edit or delete it. On the portfolio page, you'll be able to see which coins have what percentage in your portfolio. But for now, it's just 100% XRP because that's the only coin that we've put in. And then you can change the format in which your entries show in your portfolio. That brings us to the end of this tutorial. Until next time.